Hi, this is Dave of the Math Gives You Power channel, where the ring never ends. The homeless slope dude. Today we're going to examine the question, is numerate a scam? We're going to refer to the commenters, why they say it's a scam. Then I'm going to give my answer at the very end. Plus, I'm going to give some bonus information on what you would have to do if you're stuck in a subscription to numerate that you can't get out of. I'm going to give you my opinion of, of how you can pretty sure get out of it. So just hang on and we'll refer to all that. Okay, now we're going to go over the comments I had on that earlier video. What's wrong with Numerade that addresses this question? Is Numerade a scam? Let's go over these here. Here we have a comment from Yes, thank you for your video and please keep this up for everyone to see. I signed up for a free trial but then canceled the same day I signed up seeing how horrible their answers were and so this is a complaint uh, right here about the quality of the work not satisfied but was still charged the annual subscription of hundred dollars even after I canceled the trial so there was a free trial and and uh, it says uh, it was extremely difficult to get a refund all right so what happens when at the end he mentioned scam to me the, the product was deficient, but the main complaint was the difficulty getting a refund. So let's go ahead and look at a, another comment. Uh, I, uh, this is another teacher, Brian Bernard, got the email invitation to be a teacher also. It was hard to find their rates on the website, but the rates were, were low, even though apparently the video creating rates are higher than when I examined this a little over a year ago. And then says uh, still painfully low to be worth the time to produce anything of quality and that was what I looked at if I really did a video of up to my standards of quality I would have been able to make any kind of money on the deal uh, even close to minimum wage okay you confirmed my prediction of how low their quality must be if people are having to rapid fire garbage just to put in enough volume to make the income worth it. Now what I saw was not really garbage exactly. It, it could have been okay if it was refined. Uh, I'd rather spend 10 hours on one good video than 10 minutes on one bad video. So uh, I and a lot of other creators here really are careful about our content. So I hope you consider subscribing and being exposed to good content. Okay, here's uh, Darren. What a shock! In a hyper-capitalist system, there was a motivation to create a company that charges students lots of money to cheat on their homework. Now, I'm going to focus on this word, cheat. Uh, pays their experts little or no money for content answers and pockets the difference that make. I'm shocked to find there's gambling going on. And this reminded me of a movie. I thought it was like Music Man, but I come to think of it, this is from arguably the greatest movie ever made, a uh, quote which is from uh, Casablanca recommended movie Casablanca Humphrey Bogart Ingrid Bergman okay a cheat now I'm gonna go ahead and push back on this cheat a little bit because what happens the way numerate and they're pretty specific about this when they give you a problem to work on they're giving you a problem from an existing publisher but you're not to do that problem you're supposed to make a, a an alteration to that problem and so technically it's not cheating if you're given a sample problem and then that working out that sample shows you how to do that published problem. So uh, to me, that's not cheating. I, I, I find that okay in their practice. Uh, here, Numerate is a scam. It's, it's a trap for students, a Canadian college student. They charge even for free trials. See, that's a scam-like feature. If you're charging for trials that are supposed to be free, and almost impossible to cancel your subscription. So that implies that it was possible but difficult. So that's a scam-like feature. If you're not responsible uh, enough in your in what you have for service to, to cancel your subscription, that's a problem. Here we have from one of my greatest subscribers, Nora, the Stock Explorer. Uh, better off on YouTube and here's my response to her as creators and I'm talking to Nora now you and I are realistic enough to know that we don't know and cannot know at all 
So, so we know we're better off when we expose the validity of our content by hearing from others. And so that's what I do on this channel. Every single video I've posted, I have comments available and I respond to these comments. And so there's a peer review or student review on everything I do. And sometimes uh, I'll get criticisms of, of inaccuracies and sometimes those criticisms are right. Other times I'll have to defend myself. So here's, uh, I was examining the work of Numeraid's creator Lily, who is from Johns Hopkins University. Now Johns Hopkins University is really to me a top 10 university in this country. I mean it's right up there in my mind with the Ivy League. So that's, so that, that is great. And she w had every uh, demeanor and confidence of a com competent teacher. But here, this problem right here, I'm going to reenact this one, fx equals x minus 7 or x squared minus 4x plus 3. She identified properly in explaining how to graph this, the vertical asymptotes at x equals 1 and x equals 3. But then what she did is she had, she had it set up uh, something like this for the graph. And this graph I'm drawing right now is incorrect because it doesn't take into account properly the sign of what's going on in the numerator. I'm going to draw a more correct representation of what's blue here, of what it looks like. And what happened is that Lily didn't put it in her calculator to check her work. And I don't even blame her personally so much for that. There just wasn't sufficient editorial oversight. And so really the system let her down. So uh, check your work. It, it, but if this is on YouTube, YouTube then like my videos, somebody would be able to come along and say, hey, that's not right. And then I would be able to take down the video or correct it somehow. So that is a fault of, of the system. And here's a, another question. How can I cancel my subscription there? please, uh, I need major help. Okay, of course, it says you can email the services directly requesting cancellation. I expect that failing that, you can somehow notify a credit or debit card company. And when I buy things, particularly that, that I, I'm not 100% sure of, of their quality, I always try to go by credit. I'm a customer of Discover Card, and and uh, they one of their claims is they can get money back if you purchase it and there's something wrong with your purchase or if for, to delay ongoing charges you can contact your credit card company or your debit card company okay now I've given you the information why my viewers think that numerate is a scam and I'm gonna go ahead and weigh in I kind of don't look at it exactly that way and here's here's what I think if I hire a contractor to do my roof and the the work is not exactly right and needs to be redone um, a poor quality work is not but to me by definition a scam if it can be corrected if, if there's some response if I can get a hold of the of the contractor but the problem I see with Numerade is the inaccessibility of the contractor to to give feedback about the quality of their work and in this case of uh, getting charges to your credit or debit cards refunded and so that really has a strong element of scam so I think that's the main reason so if I had to give now this is a qualitative definition if I had if you had to give me a rating of what how much of you raise a scam um, and I haven't seen all their work. I'm thinking maybe, maybe about 30% scam because it's really a, leaves a bad taste in your mouth not to be able to get that refund and to cancel subscription. But that doesn't mean the whole thing is a scam because there is a definite product for what they do, no matter how how you judge the quality of it. So anyway. That's what I think about it. I hope this has been helpful to you. Uh, and if you decide to go with Numerate, I hope you learn something from it. Take care, and thanks for viewing.